Well, that was a bust. Um, I didn't really couldn't record in the aisles because there was a whole bunch of employees putting stuff out. Um, one guy actually came up to me and asked what I was looking for. He scanned a couple pegs. They didn't have what I was looking for. Anyways, so on to the next stop. I'm gonna hit a uh, Walmart because it's right here across the street, and then I'm gonna go down to the other Target in Plainville, Goodwill and Savers. We're both busts. Um, might be uh, an empty-handed day, but that's all right. You don't need to buy something every day. Let's keep going. Yep, pretty empty. Minus the stuff that's been here forever. What are they putting these guys in clearance? <laughs> uh, nothing, nothing. Random frog man. Uh, uh, most of the other Walmarts I've been to have all these gone in clearance, so I'm surprised they're not here. Uh, uh, nothing new. Tempting to get that bane. But that's it. Let's keep looking. Save target, save the day. Target number two. Alright, as per usual. Nothing. Uh, it's some wrestlers. Look at these guys. I don't collect them, but cool, eh? <laughs> so they had something. It just lines up. Just the usual. Primes, Prime, Sakona. Somebody said he's hard to get. He's looking at this. First time seeing him. He's coming home. <laughs> nothing new, sadly. Or nothing I'm looking for. They have a bunch of these at 30% off. I don't know if anybody <clears throat> missed them. Runabout. I think they're all runabout. Yeah. Let's get it and see what it goes for. But <clears throat> nothing else. Some of these. Here little figures. But meh. Alright. What's up guys? Here with my little say hi. <laughs> little eyes. Uh, target number one, Walmart number one, was a complete bust. So let's see what they got. Uh, all the same suspects that they've had. The Joker is kind of cool, but uh, on our way in, we got lucky. I usually little put three boxes of those out and four of these. There was another guy standing there, so we split them. So, cool, cool. Uh, the Ghostbusters. But not much else. Keep looking. Uh, and this guy. I was always an Undertaker fan, but I mean, like, honestly, who wasn't? I don't collect them, so I'll stay here for somebody else. Under the Giants. I've seen these guys a lot, so. Uh, Jar Jar. Same guy. Cars. DeLorean. Keep looking. <laughs> Halloween 3 sets. Back to the future. Not really, pal. Nothing that we're looking for. Alright, let's keep moving. What's up everybody? It is Wednesday afternoon, noon time. Uh, I've already hit up two stores. Uh, where did I go? I went to Walmart, which was a complete bust. Went to Target. Uh, nothing for toys, but they did have, uh, the lady must have just put it out, is the Pokemon Shining Fates. Um, I got one, one uh, booster box and then two of the four packs. So, it was cool. We I got there at the same time as like this other guy did, and 
we split them. Uh, there was three of the big boxes. You could only take three items uh, at this place. So, you know, you couldn't have taken them all anyway. But he was nice and gave me one of the bigger boxes. Um, I don't know if he was going to take all three, but I asked for one. And he's like, yeah, take it, man. Um, so, cool. We're on our way to Target number two and Walmart number two. Um, and then we're just going to head home. Uh, little Bear's with me. And I'm going to take him to the playground because it's almost 50 degrees out. So, let him go play. I promised him that. That's what we're going to do today. So, all right, guys. Stay tuned. We'll see what we see. Bye-bye. Saw these in this cart. I don't collect them, but they're cool. This Wolverine's cool. Yeah, keep moving. Dang. All right, guys. NECA at Target number two. Regular toy aisle is no good, but this is that new line. He's one of the ones I'm looking for. See if they have ghost face. Here, hold that bell. Hey. Don't wreck it. I don't see him. Well, we want ghost face. And they don't have them. No ghost face. One of the ones we wanted, so. Oh, oh, look. He's down here by himself. All right. Mission accomplished. We got something we wanted. You say, hooray. Hooray. <laughs> All right. Let's keep going. Walmart number two. Pretty stocked. Uh, the Gandalf is cool. I kind of want it. Get a bunch of these. Uh, I say stocked, but I mean like in terms of Walmart stocks. This is pretty good. No. Let's keep looking. All right. Uh, got a headband there. Do, do, do. Fall. You're not gonna fall. fall. You get the regular Batman. I think these are the same ones that have been here forever. Uh, like literally, it's pretty bad. All right. Well, sorry for wasting your time, people. All right, let's keep looking. It's only Wednesday, so I got two more days. Good afternoon, everybody. Good morning, still. It's only eleven o'clock. Uh, I'm going to meet. I'm going to meet somebody. <laughs> uh, he, he's buying one of the runabout transformers I picked up the other day. Uh, local guy, so I gave him a good deal. And going to meet him right now. And then I'm going to hit up Target and Savers. And then I got to go to Brunel's. They have an auction preview today because there's an auction tomorrow night. Um, a lot of comics, but. We'll see what else they have. Because uh, there's always stuff that they have that isn't in the pictures online. Um, but you always got to check it out. You just don't know. So I'm going to be there. And I'm going uh, to be there tomorrow night. And I'm going to hit up the savers on the way there. And it generally has nothing. But hey. Eh, you never know. I've gotten stuff there before. But it's been a long time. So and then we'll... Maybe hit up something around there afterwards and then just come back home because I got a lot of shit to do. Yeah. Anyway, all right, stick around. Let's see what we see. Later. All right, guys. Beyblades. I got these guys. If you've never seen them, they're kind of squishy. Um, found this one. These are an ultra rare. Uh, these can actually, some of these can go for good money, so keep an eye out for it. And I found, found her. No legends. Just only a bunch of those guys. And then they had a couple new ones. They have the Robin. I don't really care for the Robin, to be honest with you. Um, and they had two of her. So, I'm gonna keep looking. So, that was pretty much the same. Nothing. So. Alright, it's Mosey. Must have just put these guys out. There's two Spider Man. Those two, and these two. I'm gonna grab these two because I have friends looking for them. Uh, Alright, keep going. Alright, Walgreens. 
have hit Massachusetts. Fortunately, they didn't have the trooper like I wanted, but I'll grab a Zartan and screw it. I'll grab the Redeco. Why not? I got the Silver Surfer. But I don't do Legends. So. But they finally restocked. So. I will take them. Peace out. Alright, guys. Just hit a Walmart. And. Uh, I got the Red Hood. So I think he's 20 bucks now as opposed to 20, uh, 15. So. I'm gonna grab the Red Hood. Nobody else I need. I think it's better than the other. Uh, I don't think so. Right. Yeah. Let's see what else they have. Uh, wheel jack. A couple of the headmasters. Yeah, Chrome Dome. That's it. We'll keep looking. Alright, stopped at Walgreens to look for Joe's. They got the Silver Surfer. And look at that. Two of these. Oh, awesome. Yeah, what else do they got here? Oh, I'm looking. Tona, Baraka. Alright, nothing, nothing crazy, but I got my Joe's, sweet, alright, alright, uh, Target had the usuals, and then her, just randomly sitting around, car's a little bent, so maybe that's why people haven't picked her up, but don't care, I'm gonna grab her, uh, the usual suspects, you don't see him too much, <clears throat> he's a nice piece though, but I don't do him, so, and then tons of Grimlock. Do, do, do. Uh -huh. Yeah. Wrestlers. Brand new. And cap. Nothing I want. Cool though. Hey guys, Justin here. I just want to show you my retail hunting pickups from last week. Uh, it was a pretty good week, as you can see, and it's pretty much up through to today, which is Monday the 8th, right? Yeah, so I'm just going to kind of tell you everything I got and where I got it. Uh, Shift that guy there. Yeah. All right, so first off, I'll just start with my favorite stuff, the G.I. Joe Classified Series. Um really cool to actually get lucky and find all these in the wild and you know i was hunting for them but not hard hunting for them because i do have them on pre-order ran into them picked up so i can probably just cancel my pre-orders on most of these these two were actually pre-orders from big bad toy store i ordered way 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 back um i actually forgot i pre-ordered them there because i had gotten them from gamestop found a couple in the wild and you know so whatever so they've shipped so now i have two more red ninjas uh but you can't really have too many of an army builder so i got those guys there these four came from walgreens which is really cool i stopped in last friday i had a haircut uh and there's a walgreens right now where i get my haircut and these two were sitting on the shelf this is actually my second zartan um but i don't mind having duplicates of harder to find guys um, this is the Redeco paint version of hey, Roadblock. I don't know why I said Heavy Duty. Uh, the Roadblock, and he's a darker color. Uh, I'll show you the other one. Hang on. All right, as you can see, the difference. He's darker colored uniform pretty much all over. Um, I think he's more like cartoon accurate colors wise. Um, I actually do like the darker colored version one more than, than the original, but... I already have the original open, so I'm not going to open that one to be the same. There's no no reason to. So uh, The Zartan's cool. I've opened it before and showed you guys. These guys, I got really lucky. Uh, I was really surprised. 
I found them at a Walgreens. The two of them, most Walgreens are only getting two of these because uh, they're not getting full cases of them because they get them in like their repack boxes. I walked in yesterday after the flea market um, in, in Raynham and lo and behold, they were just sitting there on the shelf with a whole bunch of other new toys. So I guess they're all starting to restock the areas. So definitely keep an eye out if you guys are looking, they're hitting the area. If they hit us here in Massachusetts, then they're probably hitting just about everywhere. Um, grabbed a couple more of the DC universe, multiverse guys that I've been wanting. Uh, Red Hood I found yesterday at Walmart. There was two of them. I only needed one. I have another Red Hood from a different DC line that fits with the multiverse size really well, which I really like. He's based more on the video game version, so I might just keep him out of the package and just keep this one in the box for now. Um, I do like it. Otherwise, I wouldn't have grabbed it. But nice figure. Uh, I got the death metal Batman, finally found him, which is really nice, so I can take him out and put him on the bike. The bat bike is going to be awesome, so very happy to find that piece. And then the Batman Earth 11, uh, why can't I actually think of what her name is? Um, where does I drop it? I don't know. You guys know her name. Uh, the Drowned, that's it, yeah. So... I found her quite a few times now. Um, I wasn't originally going to get her. I picked her up because I'm trying to get a lot of the bad guys from the Death Metal series um, or the Metal series in general. And I had to grab her. So, yeah, why not? I'll put her up with the rest of the the, ev the evils on the shelf. Uh, also, at another Target last week, I found five of these runabouts on the shelf. They were on clearance, so I picked them all up. I've sold them all except for this one. Um, so, I mean, <laughs> why not? You know, it made, made it so I can have more money to do other things and keep my business going. So, you know, nice piece, and it's not something I personally want in my collection because he wasn't in the cartoon movie, so I don't mind. Nice piece, though. He's a cool figure. Um, Grab these two guys locally, uh, obviously local. Oh, this is local. <laughs> Got these at uh, another Target last week. Um, I was looking to pick up the Creeper as well, but the only one they had there, his head had fallen off, and they were only going to give me 10% off, which is like a buck twenty at that point. So I just figured I'll wait around and I'll find him again. Um, but Ghostface was one of the ones I really, really wanted. So I'm going to open him up and put him in the case with the rest of the guys. And my cousin might be grabbing the other one off me. Um, my cousin's husband. They were interested, so I just got to double check with him if he actually still wants it. Otherwise, it'll just be put aside. Um, these guys, I grabbed Roboto yesterday. Um, and Shira I found today at Target I, after I brought Xander to get his haircut. Um, it was weird because usually she's the first one gone out of the lot, out of the box. She was the only one on the shelf with, you know, all the He-Man and uh, Skeletors. So I wonder if just because this card's a little beat up that nobody wanted her. I don't care. I was at the flea market yesterday and everybody that had her wanted 25 bucks for her um, or 30 bucks, and I wasn't paying that for it. I know that's pretty much retail on eBay, but I'm a hunter. I hunt for this stuff. I find it and I found it. Yeah, it's a little beat up, but I don't care. She was one of the few I wanted. I didn't plan on picking him up originally, but once I had him in hand and looked him over, he looks really cool. Um, so, <laughs> I'm just going to hang <clears throat> hang on to him, but I'm trying not to get too deep into this line, just picking up the ones I really like. So, I uh, found a couple more of these last week. The Magneto spoken for, he's going to my buddy Mike. Uh, the Hulk I picked up for somebody else that asked me if I found another Hulk to pick it up, but I can't remember who it was, so if it was you, let me know. Um, you know, and I can sell them off to you. So, cool figures. These are nice. I only kept the uh, Spider-Man so far. Uh, and then I picked these guys up at Walmart. They were on clearance. They were actually cheaper than the clearance tags are on it. They were knocking it down again while I was there. They only had one full set, and I know there was a lot of people looking for these. I'm not a Power Rangers guy, but it's something nice to have once the yard sale, we start doing our uh, outdoor toy sales again. So I'll definitely hang on to those. And then last but certainly not least, we got some trading cards. I know some of you guys are like, I don't care about trading cards, but uh, walked in last Wednesday to a Target and they were putting out Pokemon cards. 
So I grabbed some. I grabbed the new Shining Fates boxes. I grabbed uh, these ones. These were these retail for like 20 bucks a piece, and these are 50. They resale for pretty much double. Um, I'm basically just gonna hang on to them for now. Um, could be a bad investment, could be an alright investment. Not really an investment, just kind of something to put away because, you know, Pokemon's hot right now. So, um, like I said, Pokemon's hot. Sorry, something was going on. Uh, so, still just looking around. Uh, I grabbed these today at Target, which I didn't realize until I was ringing out. They're hobby packs at Target. Um, so, I figured why not. I do like the baseball, and I was grabbing them anyways long before I saw the hobby part. But it's kind of cool to see hobby packs just out as a box at Target. I don't know if it was a mistake, but they rang up, so who knows. Uh, found these at Walgreens. Had no idea they would be at Walgreens. Um, I didn't expect them there. Those are going to be for sale, too, because I don't do basketball. So, you know, it's part of the stuff I'm flipping. But that's it, guys. Found some really cool stuff this week. Super excited to find the Joe stuff, especially the infantry guys. And then to find uh, the bat the Death Metal Batman was really cool. Um, so, you know, I hunt every week. I go out every week looking for stuff. Um, it's starting to get a nice weather this week. Supposed to be in the high 50s and 60s here in Mass. Um, so a lot of people, I'm sure, are going to be starting to get back out there. And I know um, my buddy Greco told me about a local toy show we're actually going to, uh, which is awesome. It's the first real indoor toy show in forever. Um, they're doing timed entries, which is something I've never seen before. Uh, but basically they were selling 40 tickets per hour and you can go in for an hour. So I don't know if like they clean out the room and then let anybody in. Guess we'll find out how that works. Uh, but really excited for that. And then I know it's super, super early, but we're doing our backyard toy sale again. We're going to be doing it in, uh, I believe it's May 1st at uh, the same location we've done the others. So definitely keep an eye out for that. I will put something together for that when it's a lot closer. And so will my buddy Greco. So make sure you guys keep an eye out for that. And that's everything, guys. So hit me up on Facebook and Instagram. Uh, I really appreciate all the support I've gotten lately. We've broken over 8,000 subscribers. We're at almost 8,100 now. Uh, my goal by the end of the year was originally, hopefully, 10,000. Who knows? Maybe we can still make it. Uh, I know it's slowed down a little bit, but I got a bump from my buddy Retro Rick. So it was nice. I appreciate everybody that came over for that. And uh, yeah, so keep on trucking, guys. And check out my Facebook page. Uh, check out my Instagram. You'll see all this long before it gets on the video. And I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Later.